Good morning. Now today is going to be me sitting here showing you stuff. And then if you have a question about it, ask me, okay? And you might think, why did she buy that? Because when I was in Goodwill, I had a buggy full of stuff. And people probably thought, what in the world is this woman doing? This I got. Um, it was red, and I'm sure a lot of people probably thought well, Christmas. But I'm going to put my little flowers in here and put them on my counter, and it'll be for Valentine's Day. So I got that to put flowers in, okay? For Valentine's. I saw this little bag. I, said, I just thought it was cute. Isn't that cute? And I know it's a summer bag, but it was a dollar ninety one. And see, when I go see Mama, I have to take like you know stuff to paint her nails and take off her nail polish and just different things that are down there. So I thought this was a cute little bag for me to carry stuff in. For look at my little manatee. Isn't he cute? The things you can find at Goodwill. He was $2.92. Isn't he cute? And I haven't even showed him to her yet. I dote on my mama. I just love her. And look at this. It's a fish platter. Isn't he cute? I'm going to take it down to Pensacola. And when me and Chris fry fish or have friends over and I cook, even if I don't fry fish, I can serve them on a fish platter. It was $2.92. Isn't that cute? I got all kind of stuff. Let's see what else is in the bag. Oh, guess what else I got? I don't know if y'all like this or not. I have a 1999 Lincoln Town Car. That's what I drive. Because I went to get my daughter something cheap because we don't. Don't over. Oh, we don't spend a lot of money on their cars because they're gonna wreck them anyway. And I didn't want to spend but five thousand dollars on her car. And every car we drove was the biggest piece of crap. There was something wrong with something on it, major. And I found a 1999 Lincoln Town Car with eighty seven thousand miles on it. And you know how nice those are and how nice they ride. So I got it, and she got my. She's actually driving a newer car, and I'm having to pay a hundred dollars a month extra. Because she's in my newer car than what I'm driving. Because she drives a 2000. My old car was a 2008 Lincoln MKZ. So um, she's driving that 2008 Lincoln, and I'm driving the 1999 Lincoln. And guess what it has in it? A cassette player, and it has a cigarette lighter in it. So, I, whenever I go into Goodwill and different places, I pick up cassettes so that I can play them in the car. This is, oh, brother, we're out. Where art thou? Y'all know that crazy movie. I think it's so funny. So, I just had to pick it up and get a laugh while I'm in the car. Now, guess what else I bought? I bought this bag. See how nice that is? It's purple. It's like a dark purple. And um, it was $4.94, but it's really nice. And it is a Ricardo Beverly Hills. I don't really know what that is. But when you open it, let me put take this stuff out. I'm going to show you because I bought some stuff. But when you open it, it's lined, you know, like with uh, nice material. It's also got a little baggie in it for organization. See, so I was thinking about taking this one and organizing it for my work and putting stuff in it. Or for mom, I have either one because I have to take so much stuff to her. But that's a really nice bag for $4.95, isn't it? So I got that. Then I got these for mama's room. She has a little table before you walk in her room um, where she lives, and I always decorate it up. And these were 99 cents. Isn't he cute? Can y'all see him okay? I don't know how, how the lighting is doing in here. Isn't he cute? I'm going to leave him down here at the bottom. He's so cute. And he could be our friend. He could be our friend during our conversations today. Because I think I got another one somewhere. Okay, I got him. And I got this little sign. Now, it's old as the hills. 
and it's wood. Um, it was 99 cents too. But at, when you walk in Mama's room, she's got a little bitty skinny wall that I always hang something that's seasonal on. And so I'm going to trade it out. Right now it's got the three hearts that are like in my um, kitchen window right here. So I'm going to change it out for Easter when it comes. Now you can't go in Goodwill and buy stuff like this every day. If you did, your house would be a pile of junk. But it's okay to go in every once in a while. And then look at this. Isn't that the cutest little thing you've ever seen? I thought it was so cute. It was $1.91. It has the rabbit head at the top. I think it's tall enough I could put a flower in it for Mama for Easter or the spring and put it in a room. Um, so I'm thinking about using it like um, fresh flowers to put in a room and and letting it be a low arrangement and put it in here for her. And if I don't do that, I could just make her a little Easter basket surprise for Easter morning. Mama has really been thinking better. And when Mama's thinking better, I can do things like this and it really matters. Now, if she was full, now there was, there's been times when she didn't have really and truly a lick of sense. That sounds terrible, but it's true. So when, when she's like that, I don't do these extra things, but when she's in a good state of mind like she has been for the last few weeks, I try to get my good memories in there, you know? She has been doing so much better, y'all. All right, now you've seen all my things. Uh, this view makes me look, um, you know, y'all are kind of, you're going to kind of see a lot of me. Hey, Rhonda, thank you. She's she's telling me that I'm sweet, taking care of my mama. I, I don't take care of her, though. I just dote on her. Thank God for my daddy because they divorced when I was in high school. And when they divorced, um, daddy, mama was always a spendthrift, always. Um, so she, daddy knew that if he left her money, that she was spending all and she would have because everything he did leave her she don't have anymore so what he did is he gave her alimony for the rest of her life um no matter what so mama's alimony along with her social security pays for where she is mama lives in a private home it's really really nice i'll take y'all in there sometime while we're doing my regular page and let you meet mama and let you see the place because it's really nice um and the firm that i worked for for years actually drew it but i didn't know that until after i moved her in because i mean i hadn't worked in a while there um but anyway thank god for that um and mama put up enough out of with that out of my daddy to deserve that alimony for the rest of her life too i love my daddy to pieces but he was something else as a husband. Leslie says, when my friend Lori, the one you remind me of, and I went to Goodwill, when we first met, we were looking at purses and I picked one up and smelled it inside and she looked at me strange. And I told her you have to smell the inside because you don't know what people had in it. <laughs> and the one she liked, she smelled and like, and lo and behold, it smelled like cat pee. Yeah, you've got to be careful. A lot of these people have cats, and they let them pee in their house. It's the nastiest thing. Um, matter of fact, when you go in Goodwill, it stinks to me. It just stinks. And so when I bought those two red pillows, I smelled of them. Of course, those are things I can actually wash, uh, Leslie. Thank goodness. I can throw them in the washing machine. I'll check your invites for the new page. Thanks for tuning in, and y'all get to see plenty of me because this new page, y'all get to ask me anything you want to all the time. Love you.